Thanks, Ryan. Well, the public got a look at a new $9 million assisted living and memory care center in North Jackson today. The new facility comes at a time where more families are looking at options for aging loved ones. 27 First News reporter Julie Bursick has that story. Mary Kay Pappas and her mom Irene sit down for a minute in the new dining area at the Antonine Sisters' new assisted living and memory care center. There's a lot to see. We have uh, memory care, 21 rooms. We have assisted living, 24 rooms. We have suites, 10 rooms. Irene Pappas is part of the Sisters' adult daycare program. Comes pretty much every day. Mary Kay says the new addition is something worth looking into for her mom. Thinking about it, she's going to be 90 in about three weeks. It's a conversation more families are starting to have. Shepherd of the Valley is seeing more seniors at its facilities. More and more seniors make the decisions for themselves um, because as our population does age, we have a lot of seniors that are getting the information on their own, getting on the internet, looking for that information. Shepherd of the Valley says there are a lot of options in the Tri-County area, but it boils down to three things. The finances, it comes down to location, and it comes down to the services that are needed. For Copio suggestion for families, start asking questions now. No matter how old you are, no matter what type of health care decision you have in front of you. You need to know your options. Back in North Jackson, the new center says it's ready to meet those needs and families are already interested. It's just waiting on its license from the government. And they give us inspection. Okay, go ahead. Then we'll be able to take people. In Mahoning County, Julie Bursick, WKBN 27 First News.